Hello everyone, this is Leslie from the whole shebang. Welcome to my channel. This is a little different kind of video that I'm doing today. Um, I, a lot of, because of the pandemic, I've been doing different kind of things and I'm just going to show you. This is actually, I'm doing, um, this because I went looking for this video last weekend and couldn't find it. So I decided to be the person, at least one person to put it up. This is a puzzle that I did. I love to do puzzles on the weekends. This is called, um, it's a, my favorite brand of puzzle, which is Ravensburger. I don't get paid to say that. It's called Ravens, a Ravensburger puzzle. They have this thing called soft t uh, click technology. Anyway, you can just see that the puzzle pieces are really, really nice. The other thing I do like about it is that I will show you, it's all a square. It's, it's, it's extremely difficult, but it, it's a little easier for me to do it. And I just really, if you're someone who does puzzles, I strongly encourage you to pick up one of these. I picked this up. I wasn't familiar with this. I'm familiar with the brand, but not this sub uh, subcategory. I've seen these before. W-A-S-G-I-J. -J. It's jigsaw spelled backwards. I picked this one up. Um, I don't know where, but anyway... It's got a thousand pieces. I'd like to do usually 500, but anyway, I picked this one up and it is basically, this is not, this is the, the, the view that you are supposed to imagine what this, what this scene will look like in 50 years. I think it says, can you see what their future is going to be? So normally when you do a puzzle, you are doing the puzzle that is shown the the picture that is shown on the box. Here you had to imagine what this scene would look like in 50 years. For instance, this is the puzzle that I am working on now. This is a 500 piece Ravensburger puzzle. And this is the puzzle that I am doing. It is called the Bizarre Bookshelf, uh, Bookshop. This is the puzzle piece that I am, the puzzle that I am working on now. And it is exactly that puzzle, if you can see. This puzzle, on the other hand, is not that puzzle. It is not that photo. So this is what it, there was a clue given on the back. So this old fashioned car becomes this, I'm gonna call it a hot rod. My kids were making fun of me for calling it a hot rod. Anyway, so it was very difficult. It was very challenging. There was nothing to do, um, no real guidance for this. I it was able to see one photo on an eBay puzzle that someone was selling, but it was really difficult to see, and I was doing it on my phone. Anyway, this was the final product. This was the final product of what that jigsaw puzzle looked like. Would look, uh, what that puzzle, that scene would look like in 50 to 70 years. And it was not a lot of guidance. For instance, like there was in this one, there is a parking garage over here. And there really is no parking garage or anything like that. It, it was just very difficult. Just very difficult. I will also tell you, this is why I like the Ravensburger puzzles. If you can see, basically, every single puzzle piece, I say is a square, it's, it's not, but it's a square. You can count how many pieces there are in the puzzle because it's, for this, for instance, it should be 20 by 50 across, which would be a thousand. So this puzzle, if you were looking at it, if you went to the internet and wanted to see what this puzzle look like, this is it. It was really difficult. I hope this helps you in any way. You can see I am missing one piece right there. But anyway, this was, I love doing puzzles. I do them all the time. Um, it's, it's, I love doing it. I don't sit around and watch TV or if the TV is on, I, I, I'm doing a puzzle with the TV on in the background. Anyway, this is Leslie. If you do puzzles, let me know what you think of this one, what you think of Ravensburger. I thought this puzzle was very, very difficult. I don't know that I would ever do this again unless I had a really good photo or an image of what to look for. 
because this was really difficult. Um, this is Leslie. Let me know in the comments below what kind of puzzles you like or what kind of brands you like. And if you like this kind of, uh, I don't know, this brand of puzzle. This, I mean, this Destiny, I think it's called. I looked it up. And I, I don't know. I just thought it was ridiculously difficult. Anyway, Leslie, uh, this is Leslie. Let me know. Welcome to, um, welcome to my channel. If you are new, please consider subscribing. Thank you. Bye-bye.